scared to death Mazzy, scared to death. I'm just doing a product review. That'll be on uh, Desperate Dan Discovers, right? That's uh, energy food. Anyway, bang! Big bang! Yeah. What was it? What was it? Scary, wasn't it? Now, I got a beer out. I've got two beers left, Mazzy. The John Smiths, I mean. And they were too cold this morning. Oh. So I've got them out. So the fridge ain't working properly then. And I got two of them out. Um, and just heard a bang. That's proper frozen. Frozen. Ew. <laughs> That's my Guinness Zero. Takes a lot for them to pop in a freezer you know i don't know there's another one there but that's not even a freezer it's a fridge isn't it so, so two of them have gone i'd say they're all knackered so this fridge might not be any good after all it seem, don't seem to be working do it it might be okay for frozen things yeah yeah it doesn't yeah. seem to be working luckily i think we've got another one on the way what, from another fridge? company yeah I thought you were going to say, luckily you got a John Smith. No, I haven't. Not happy. You may as well turn it off then. It's not doing its job. Look at it. On the plus side. <laughs> ah, that's annoying. Never mind. They've been working out here, look. Yeah, lads have been doing great. So they've rotivated all this. Uh, they've put some more soil down here made it a lot neater and then they're gonna grass that and you're not even gonna know by no couple of months you won't do, even know do, the does that have to be flattened uh yeah when you're seeding it all oh, right i see yeah i notice there's people on us old pitch now oh yeah oh yeah I same morning think. as us they're just putting it up they're yeah just today. <laughs> if we could change awnings we would but we love this awning it's always been good for us. It's been good. But I think we're sick of the... We're sick of seeing it. Seeing it, yeah, yeah. <laughs> We'd like something different. <laughs> so it's been quite a busy day, really, isn't it, sort of? So to say. Oh, they're fit for the bin. No. <laughs> You're going to tip them out first? Is that a thumbnail in there? What, with you not percent not <laughs> I can't speak. Not percent beer. My beer's exploded. So, got my first bit of my new look just being delivered. Corduroy flares by Madcap England. And my Madcap England t-shirt and my Hey Dudes for my holiday, red. I've got some beige ones coming tomorrow, I think. What do you think, Mazzy? Well smart. Quality of that clothing is good, isn't it? The quality is fantastic. I just hope the size is right. So yeah. I'm going to try these on now. Oh yeah. I'm going to give you a little prance. Prance. <laughs> Who wants to see a Dan Mod prance? Right, I think he's ready. Come on then. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> we are the mods. Ooh. We are the mods. We are, we are, we are the mods. Oh, do you know what? The red shoes look well cool with that. Yeah, looks nice. I'm very happy. I ain't, got, I ain't even got a belt on. You said you were worried this was going to be too big. Yeah, they big. did look big, didn't no, they? They fit perfect. The only downside yeah. is the top. It's one of them which shows me belly. Would <laughs> you go for extra large? This is large. No, no, that size fits you nice. It does. It's just, I wish I were a bit slimmer, maybe. Back in them days, they didn't go around in big baggy clothes did they <laughs> looks well smart babe you look well handsome I feel, it. I feel it yeah you look really good so on vinted and ebay there's other people selling this madcap stuff yeah and someone had a top which i really like same kind of thing different design um they were offering it for 25 pounds and now they've gone down to i think 15 pounds did i say i think so yeah same size so i'm gonna go on there now and i'm gonna buy it now that you know the size is right this is my new you look, look really handsome thank you very much <whistles> just had a message from neil saying there's a parcel in the office which i'm expecting for mazzy look at this 
dressed all this look. It didn't look fantastic earlier, but now it's dried, it looks beautiful. And they've done all this today, right from right down there, right round there, they've done so much. Anyway, yeah, Neil says, there's a parcel in the office, come and get it, and bring your camera, because there's something exciting. Well, that's nothing to do with us, surely, that's something Neil's got, which probably isn't exciting, but he thinks it's exciting, so let's go check it out. Dan, we've got some really exciting, <laughs> the most exciting news ever, because it's coming up to Easter. What do you celebrate Easter with? Jesus Christ Superstar theme track, and... Easter eggs. It's exciting, Dan. You've got no idea what's happening. We're, we're going to be daddies. It's, seriously, I'm not joking. Something wonderful has happened for, inside for Easter. Come in, mate. Come, 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 come. Where we're we going? Come, come, come here. No, come, 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 come. And this is not a wind up. Shut up. It's not a wind up. It's for real. Shut up. It's for real. We're going to be daddies. They're real. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. That's 7 each, Neil. We're going to be daddy. 7 if, each. If they if they have. Mazzy, out, if you're watching this, I'll have an omelette with my chips. No, 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 they could be fertilised. And if they hatch out, the first thing they see will become their bond. They'll just follow you forever. Is so, this not a joke? No, it's absolutely. Ducks, it's 100%. 100% genuine. It's not lined up, nothing. So the ducks I have been feeding for the last few weeks. Why have they come here and not well, stayed up my part? Oh, because that's the, that's the slums up there. But look at that, but look, look at the nest. That is incredible. That is the most exciting, wonderful nature thing I have ever seen in my life. Because we know which ducks they are as well. No, no, they're my ducks, not your ducks. No, it's Jemima. I've never named no, other ones. Gerald and Julie. No, the girl, no. the brown one, is called Jemima. That's Gerald and Julie. Oh, no, 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 no. Anyway, They're my ducks. Did you say it's the most exciting thing going? No, I'm not going into jokes. Ex ex exciting. I'm not going into your jokes, but that, that is incredible. incredible. I thought you'd like that. I do like that, yeah. That's all because I fed them well. Do not have a look down my septic tank? I don't want to look down your septic tank. Oh. Nope. My burger's gone cold with all the excitement. So this is exactly what I'm talking about. This is what it looked like all the way up. In fact, worse further up. But look at it now. Look how beautiful it's looking. I did all that. He's just taken over for the last 10 minutes. But yeah, it's looking fantastic now. Look at that. Need some trees and greenery, don't we? And Neil just gave me a really good idea. Didn't think of that. Need to get a trail cam down on them uh, eggs. We'll actually see them hatching. No excuse not to catch that. How exciting! So we got up this morning and our awning was down. Oh. Talking to the vloggers, <laughs> our viewers. So Dan's pumped it up, he found the problem, but there's a bunch of water in the middle of it. Go on, honey. What? Are they? Yeah. It don't look right. Looks very, um, I don't know. Yeah, just one of the fowls on it was a bit loose, Dan said. Good morning from Not me. Me. <laughs> Hello. Good morning. So our awning went down last night, as Mazza just told you. I was worried. <clears throat> Cause last time that happened, um how can I explain it? This little white wire here was stuck in between the, the screw and the plug and it was a very slow leak but it wasn't that this time so I was worried it was a proper puncture but turns out that one wasn't on properly so 
so I'm hoping it's okay now. Right, I've got to take you with me. I'm just going down to drop the rubbish off. But I need your opinion. Is this the best Easter present in the world for me and Neil, the campsite warden? Or is it the best April Fool's joke ever by Neil, the campsite warden? Right, the lad's doing a bit of pressure washing down here, so I have to be quick. It's quite noisy down here. But check this out, is this real? We've seen the ducks on his, on his uh, pitch. 14 eggs. I thought, oh my god, he says, we're going to have to get trail cameras there, get, film it all and everything. And he's really excited about it now. Was he overexcited? Got to remember that he told me on Thursday, it's Good Friday today, I believe it's April Fool's Day on Monday. I think the first is on Monday, Easter Monday. And wouldn't it be amazing if on Easter Monday morning we had 14, some kind of prank happen with these 14 duck eggs, which he could have bought in a shop. He could have made the nest, but no. Mazzy. The duck is sat on the eggs. It's not an April Fool's joke. It's not. No. Oh my God. 14 eggs. And it's the little lady who I've been feeding over here. I just can't understand why she's picked there of all places to lay the eggs. But it's a beautiful nest, really well made nest. Buzzing. What an Easter present. It's gonna be daddies. They can lay, I think it's between, how many would you say? Up to 15 eggs, can't the ducks? Yeah, 8 to, fi eight to 15, eight to they're 15. 14. So they are, you know, they're not massive duck eggs. I've seen big duck eggs, they're not massive. Which is another reason why I thought Neil might have bought them in a shop. <laughs> but no, it's real. Unless that's a fake duck he's put on top of there as well. Quick last minute decision. We're off to shopping. <laughs> And to the dump by the look of it. Oh, actually, babe, you'll be lucky that's open on Easter Friday. Well, it's locked, it didn't say it isn't. Really? Hmm, unusual. I've only got these and a little bit of cardboard. Yeah, I don't matter if we have to bring it back. I'm out of beer, I've been out of beer for a couple of days. <laughs> stuck with this 0% rubbish. <laughs> so, yeah. How are you fit then? Pretty much. I am. I don't want to be long. No, well, we, at least we're nice and early, so hopefully we'll beat the crowds. Yeah. So off we go. I love going shopping. It's very rare for me in here, isn't it? Because we do a lot of home deliveries. <laughs> yeah. It's nice to get off campsite. I'm wondering if to get some meat in. Meat? For a possible barbie. It's raining all week. <laughs> Don't know, it's up to you, isn't it? I'm doing a curry for Dan today, so no doubt you'll probably have leftovers of that tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. And then after that, you can have whatever you want because there's no more sort of fresh meat in the fridge. Right. Anyway, let's let's crack on with this. And once again, we're at the dump. I bet it's not opened. I bet, bet you is. bet you a cup of tea in the morning. I bet it's open and I bet it's quiet. Okay. <laughs> well, I always make your tea in the morning anyway. Yeah. <laughs> See what's happening today. There's a few up. This time of the morning. See an old fridge or freezer, darling. So it's Easter Friday, and it looks like the men have nothing else to do but go to the dump. Well, I can guess the women are involved there somewhere, aren't they? It's gonna be a bit of a job getting out now, I reckon. Well, that depends on these guys. Oh, this is like a meth and guilt. Good man. Is that an old rolls? Oh, 
Only he could park in the middle of the road like that and stop yeah, everyone to get out. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. But he's driving a Rolls, you know. Rolls Royce, come on, it's probably about 40 quid, that car. And it's gold. Somebody's a little cranky. Well, what a place to stop. Kid, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's early, I am cranky. I don't like coming out, Mazzy. I don't like people, I don't like places. There's no giving them, is there? All out for their own, aren't they? Well, it is a badly laid out place. It is, it is, but I think they do well, really. I don't know where I'm going, I'm lost. Right, left out of here and then left. We had to do a divert to come here, so I'm not sure if the road was closed off or what. But anyway, oh, actually, we did go right it last time anyway. We did. Yeah, and I'm wondering because that might be. Did we go up there? No, that's an estate. I'm not sure this is right. Is this right? I was just going to say, I've got a feeling this is wrong. I've got no signal to make it worse. Well, I must say it's busy at this time of the morning. <laughs> Isn't it? Your destination we don't care. Yeah. We're half a mile from the door, but we never mind anyway, do we? Right. Are you ready? Nearly. Nearly. Now where are you going? I don't You're want never to be happy. Near other people. Stop! Happy Easter to me, happy Easter to me, happy Easter to me, from you. Spoiled you, haven't I? What have you got me? Come on, tell them all. Well, I've got you to sort of grown up these sweets. I've got you a couple of those. Sports mixture, the best sweets in the world. Pack of those, pack Picnics, of those. the second best thing in the world. Pack of those. And all others will do, yeah. And hold on, I've got you crisps and nuts and... Oh, yeah. All last... sorts of, for last night as well. You did, I? thank you very Pringles. much. Pringles, he actually got his barbecue Pringles. What about uh, an Easter egg? Only special people get Easter eggs. Well, we got these for £2 each on sale, clearance, and one of them says special on it, Mazza, but that's yours. That's mine because I'm special. What's mine say? Talented. There you go. Talented and special. That sums us up, really. Morning. What? You should be a good boy. He's a good boy. I'm a fully grown man, but go on. Go on. Happy Easter time. Thank you very much. <laughs> Smart is orange. How much were this? Three quid? Yeah, you were tight. 50 you pence were... when I were a lad. He was picking like the cheapest one. He was being more I want, they were cheaper than that. I just fancied Smarties. It's not every day you get Smarties nowadays because they cost a fortune. Well, I love Smarties, but they're orange. Yeah. Like orange flavour, I mean. Well, I like orange Smarties. Can you remember the days when they didn't have a, a blue Smartie? There were no such a thing. The good old days. They had brown. Do they still have brown? Well, boatheads have just arrived next door, Mazzy. Have they? Yeah, for Easter weekend. Oh. Are they early? It's Friday, isn't it? Easter Friday. Yeah, yeah. Did you know it's 2,024 years to the day since Jesus was doing knots and crosses or something? Knots and crosses? Yeah. Um, what were I going to say? Yeah, they're not going to have an electric <laughs> when they get in the have van. Have you told him? Well, he's had a chat with an electrician, so he'll know. Oh, we've got it now. Oh, it's back, back, back on, it's back on. We've had it off for, we've had it off for, <laughs> for hours. <laughs> um, I'm going to be knocking two days off our electric this month. Yeah. Been yeah. bang out of order this last couple of days. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, John, the Johnsons. Right, you remember the toilet seat we were giving away? We gave it to the Johnsons. <laughs> and they sent us £20 in a PayPal. Which we never asked for or we expected. We didn't want that. Thank you so much, but you shouldn't have done that. No, back up a But you actually really helped us out because you sent it to the wrong PayPal address. Excuse me. As many, <coughs> as many people have in the past. Some people have. Our PayPal address is not Travel Trolls TV. 
Anyway, we, we... No, it is. The one... No, 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 don't confuse oh, right. it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's not. The one in the description is the yeah. right one. But some yeah. people, for some reason, I don't know where they're getting oh, it from. Yeah, let us know where you're getting that from. They sent, they sent it to a Travel Trolls email address on PayPal. And we've never been able to access that account in two years, three years. So when someone sends us money, we've just had to politely say thank you, but not be able to get the money. No, no. But this time, Mazzy says, you know what, enough's enough, so I'm going to get onto PayPal. So she was ringing PayPal, speaking to them in India and all that lot. They're really helpful. And we got £114. Pound. I bet £120 or something. £120, yeah. pounds, what had accumulated over the last few yeah. years. <laughs> so we've now got that. So thank you very much. Yeah, so you helped us you. sort that out. Um, right, what am I doing? What am I doing? I don't know, but I'm busy. Get out! Oh, what are you, what are you making? Curry. A curry? Yeah. Oh. But I'm really in the middle of about to do something, so I need you to just go. Can I just have a quick look at my curry? Yeah, it needs browning a bit more. Will you just go? Get out! There's some onion barges somewhere as well. They looked really nice. Get out! <laughs> right, I'm going to get out. I'm not welcoming my own van. It's ridiculous. Weather doesn't know what to do with itself. One minute it's sunny, one minute it's raining. Oh, Bob's back. I should imagine everyone's going to be here this weekend, aren't they? I think it was fully booked from Christmas or something silly like that. Um, so it's going to be busy over there. Tried to pick up some gas this morning, but the place I get it from, just too busy, honestly. I think last year, if I remember rightly, we went into town on the Easter Friday or Saturday and it took us an hour and a half in the traffic to get into Skegness. So this morning we went at half past eight thinking it would be okay but Tesco's was heaving. Um, and I went to that shop to change the gas and the shop was heaving so I thought, you know what, forget it. I'll, I'll do that another day after Easter. I hate going, I should never have gone out, should never go out at Easter, ever. Just tried to give my Guinnesses away, the zero alcohol, don't want it, it's not very nice. Well, it's not for me anyway. So, if there's anyone on campsite who wants, how many is there, three, four, five, six, seven cans of Guinness zero, uh, let me know, and you can have them, because two exploded. <laughs> which was the fridge's fault, not the beer's fault. Um, so I've got a few left and I don't want them. I just want them out of here because it's making it look a bit messy. It's all getting a bit messy, really. I've been making a list this morning of jobs to do. Now, we are starting up reviews properly again. And the main reason for fully deciding that was an email last night. So thank you very much for the email. It said... Um, why, why don't you get a proper job instead of free things all the time? So just to answer that question very quickly, um, there is jobs available at the moment. I could get a proper job. I could work, you know, eight in the morning till five o'clock at night for less money than I'm getting at the moment. Um be very tired, miserable, working for someone else, not being able to get up when I want to get up, not being able to, not be able to go to bed when I want to go to bed, not be able to do what I want to do, be jealous of people like me, um, and be really, really bitter like you and your comment. So that I hope that answers your question. Um, and it just made me think, you know what? I think I will start reviewing more free stuff because you can never win we haven't done a review in like three months or something but soon as we do one bang they're on your case aren't they so I said to myself right that's it reviews 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 so coming up there is a heater we have to review strange thing to review at this time of year but I'm getting paid for it uh, we've got Rio link cameras to do we've got an e-bike on the way we have got a projector and projector screen to do. Uh, the binoculars. 
Tim, Timu, Temu to finish. Uh, fridge, power bank, and some security cameras. So there's quite a few in the pipeline. And we're just going to pump them out. Because this year, we want to make a lot of money. So that we can get a house and live happily ever after. I don't mean buy a house, that's never going to happen, is it? But hopefully we can rent a house within the next year. That's the plan. So we just want to make as much money as we can, however we have to do it. If that means making review videos, we're going to do it. If that's where the money is, we're going to do it. Which is probably why people like the person who did that comment goes to work 8 till 5 to make some money. That's what people do. Um, if they can make money, they tend to make money. Does that make sense? So that's been a long morning for me. You haven't seen me for quite some time because I've been in here busy cooking. So I've got Dan uh, curry and rice going on tonight. Homemade onion barges. Um, yeah, so that's all prepared. Now, yesterday we did actually receive a lovely card. We thought this is unusual. It's not our birthday. Well, actually, I suppose we could have thought it was for Easter, I suppose, but it's not. So thank you so much. Sorry about that. I don't know where I got up to because my battery ran out once again. So, yeah, we've received this thank you card anyway, just thanking us for being so perfect and brilliant, babe. Mainly me. <laughs> Mainly me. So you know who you are. Thank you very much. We're going to hang that one up. And uh, not again. We're not saying that things are from now. No. Um, but we've got some lovely T-shirts here, which are going to be fantastic. I, I particularly like this one. Yeah. yeah Is this that's the one? Nice. Yeah, that's got. Um, what make was it? Uh, I can't remember. Paul Smith. It's got a little zebra on it. I'll tell you what. Um, Jet and David are like that. They love zebras. <laughs> Paul Smith. So got that and three Lacoste tops. So that'll be keeping me going yeah through the summer thank you very much for that yeah top notch um you said earlier yeah i don't care where it goes i want all this stuff off my table yeah what's all this yeah that needs to go up there when i'm done ironing i haven't done ironing yeah. i've done oh hold on it's funny now i've done all your ironing you're happy aren't you and this is my new clobber ready for me holiday yeah somebody let us know should dan bring this on holiday of course, I should bring this well, on. Well, no, holiday. you asked me yesterday. No, and what? I weren't sure. No, 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 no. That ain't what I was saying. I was saying, oh. should I wear it before my holiday? Oh no. No, no they need packing nice. for my holiday. Oh yeah, 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 definitely. These are smart. I love it. They're so light. It's 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 unbelievable. They're brilliant for holidays. Yeah. You have to get some of these guys. Yeah, dudes. <laughs> I love the paint splatter effect on the side. Yeah, well, I've got some beige ones exactly the same. Oh, yeah, where are they? I think they're coming tomorrow, due tomorrow. Oh. Um. So, yeah, they can go away. <gasps> that can all go in the bin. That's bad luck shoes on a table. Yeah, I know it is. Everyone, don't worry, everyone's going to say in comments, do not put brand new shoes on a table, it's bad luck. <laughs> they're going to say in comments, which does the algorithm good, which probably makes us a couple more pence, so, yeah, let's throw them on there. And when new <laughs> ones come, Mazzy, we'll put them next to it here. Just have <laughs> loads of new shoes on we'll table. We'll put a brolly over the top to protect them, Yeah, eh? yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I do love my new clothes. In fact, I've got a new, not a new, what, I bought it off Vinted, was it? What? Did I get it off Vinted? Yeah, a top. A top. from the, the, It's the same make as this Yeah. Uh, madcap. That Vinted. will be here soon. I find I've never been on Vinted, I must admit. But you've been on there and you told me some of the prices and I just thought that's that's mad. Vinted Ridiculous. it's very, very good clobber. It can be anything though. It's it's the same as eBay, surely. But the prices are amazing, no. I like eBay. <laughs> I love eBay. <laughs> no, I'm happy with what I've got. Um, so we're a bit, I just want to mention we're struggling a bit with charging things up in the minute. We've got so many things to charge up. Because when has electrics been and off? Once again, the electric we've been using power. everything up as yeah. power banks are empty. It happened yesterday, wasn't it? Just as I put the air fryer on to start your well, I'd started your dinner in the air fryer because yeah. we did we're running really low on gas. Yes, but it's back on anyway. So yeah, it's back on, but yeah, no it's been, problem. It's been one of those weeks, and it'll be gone for <laughs> weekend now, so we'll have electric all weekend <laughs> and sun and curry. Ah, don't lift them lids. 
Morning, yeah. All right, say goodbye to I everyone. I was going to wish everyone a happy Easter, but it's too early yet, isn't it? Oh, yeah. We'll be back, won't uh, we? Good Friday. It's too, early good Friday. To, it's too early to say happy Easter, everybody. Yeah. I have a good, good Friday on Good Friday. It is Good Friday. It is Easter. You all have a wonderful, wonderful yeah. break. And don't forget one thing you have to do this Easter. Remember what it's all about. What Easter is really about. It's about... At the end of your day, sitting down and watching us. I knew you were going to say something stupid. And because it's Easter, <laughs> clicking the like button, leaving a comment and making sure you're subscribed. <laughs> you sound so cool, Nate. <laughs> Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.